the Lord, Lord, the Lord's still looking out. And the biggest thing I think to see about storms, and that's why, actually, I've been doing a Bible study. We've been doing Bible study communication. But tonight, the Lord just spoke to me. And again, it's been changed four times today. And finally, finally, just before service, Eddie came in just before service. And he said, can I get, can I get a copy of it for the, the stick to go on the Internet? And I said, I'm not through with you yet. <laughs> <laughs> And so I just, this, is, this is hot, hot, hot off the press, amen. But it's about the storm, what to do in the storm, okay? Let's go to the Lord in prayer. Father, we love you, we praise your name, we thank you for your grace and your mercy. We thank you for this night, this chance to worship you and to honor you, Lord, and to just worship you in spirit and truth, Lord, and know that you've got everything under control. We trust you totally. We expect you, God, to work all things out for our good according to your word. Lord, when we can't lean on anything else, we can lean on your word. And we thank you for that. In the name of Jesus, we love you. And we praise your name. And the church said? Amen. Amen, amen, amen. amen. All right. So now it's time to start. Let's all stand up. And go to Lord Prayer. Go to Lord Prayer. Go to the side. Amen. <laughs>
be in the middle of it right now. Yeah. Amen. We're taking our prayer request to the Lord. Remember. Unspoken request. Father, it's an honor and a privilege to be here. And Father, I thank you, Lord, that you've already heard. You're already working on it, Lord. And Father, I thank you, God, that something special will take place in every last one of them. We just look and see where your hand was at. Asking you right now, Lord, to touch, to minister in a way that only you can, God. You're an awesome God. You're a powerful God. And Lord, there's nothing that you can't handle. I ask you right now, Lord, to touch and anoint each and every person here, Father. Each and every request, do what you do best. And Father, we thank you for it. In the name of Jesus, we pray. The church head. Amen. Amen, amen, amen. All right. You want to do it? You want to do it? I don't do what? You got the bucket. Just don't kick it. I wrote, I wrote, I wrote, anybody, everybody, has anybody ever wrote your bucket list for when you get ready to die? You got your bucket list you want to do? I wrote my bucket list last week. Sure enough, I want two drum, two drumsticks, three, three breasts, <laughs> a couple of pies. <laughs> uh, it's my bucket list. Three, three biscuits. And three biscuits. That's right. But we'll make sure you get a bucket. <laughs> I remember talking about Lot, Lot's wife. I mean, that, that lady, that lady uh, in, in Pompeii, she was reaching for the pearls. And I said, I don't want to think about it happening. That's not right, reaching for a drumstick. <laughs> Burn up. Go ahead. Tell me, Father, just thank you for the opportunity to take time out to come to your house tonight and share with uh, brothers and Christians. Uh, have your word proclaimed to us. Uh, you've heard the prayer requests that we've already mentioned tonight, Heavenly Father. And again, we just uh, reiterate people who have been painted by storms so bad yes. and probably need, need all the help they can get. They're talking, you know, I hear them talking about months. And some of them will never be recovered. It's just uh, lost forever. Be this often if we take it up there, Father. We know you can multiply it and uh, use it to further your kingdom. That's your son's name. Amen. 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 Amen.